What's up, y'all? My name is Ryan Olson, and I'm going to show you one of our favorite family recipes for wild game venison, what we call meatloaf muffins. It's delicious. Hang in there. It happens quick. Just because you're a hunter doesn't mean you love venison. Don't buy in. I love it now because I figured out how to cook it. Let's start this recipe with one whole white onion. Dice it up tight and brown them up. As they start to cook, I add in a little tomato bouillon and some green chilies, whether that's an Anaheim, an Ortega, whatever you want, a little bit of spice and a bunch of savory. While that changes color and falls in love, I take two pounds of fresh venison ground. I shake in some chili powder, some Worcestershire, salt, pepper, and then I add in all my onions and chilies and I just give it a good tumble. From there, I take a box of stovetop stuffing. I dump it right in there in one cup of water and I just mix everything nice and well. Now preheat your oven to 350 degrees. With a greased muffin tin, we take and just load those tins up with our venison mixture, just a level surface right to the top. While I'm doing that, we dice up some vegetables I use a little Parmesan cheese, a little seasoning, a little more tomato bouillon, and I stack those vegetables in our open tin holes. Then I crack a couple of eggs, I fill them up, easy peasy, vegetables and protein all in one, in the oven for 40 minutes at 350. You will thank me here in a minute. Cooking shows are so easy because it happens instantly. Out comes the meatloaf muffins, and the egg vegetable quiche, boom. Okay, here's the hook. We take store-bought packaged potato buds. These are like the four cheese. We add in one half cube of cream cheese. Then we use store-bought regular old brown gravy from Heinz. Get everything warm and it plates and looks like this. Meat muffin, mashed potato frosting, brown gravy syrup. Oh, it's beautiful. Same thing with your veggie quiche. Now, I just put it on there for color because I am not into the vegetables, although these were edible. Lord, thank you for tonight. Thank you for this meal. Thank you for all of our blessings. And in your name we pray. And that is the end because nobody wants to see you eat. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, God bless.